myself. No. Okay. okay, let's get everyone in. Yep. yep. Uh, yes, slash Wicked Vista. Okay, let's go ahead and roll camera on this one. Uh, stop trying. Very sure. Okay, all right. Uh, let's see. Teddy, Rafik, and Bayou are here. Uh, along. Hey, where's me? I'm not. I'm not here. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Okay, so uh, sorry I got started a little bit late. We, we, today everything got rolled back because of a few late meetings and now we're in copywriting. Okay, let's, uh, let's get everyone here. Um, Ruski and Chandra are here too as well. Let's, uh, let's discuss why we're here. All right, today we're here to do a general promotion review for D1. D1's um, promoting to senior host, yeah? Okay, fantastic. So um, I'll lead this again. Actually, it's supposed to be kind of led by Vita now, but uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and jump into it. So, objective. We're looking to uh, have a promotion review and determine if the candidate is up for promotion. Okay, so we're evaluating the following metrics. Sales, a high conversion rate of inquiries to bookings, volunteer teamwork, volunteering for above and beyond duties, hospitality, impressive guest reviews, mentioning the employee name and the experiences they shared with the employee. Communication, responsive and accurate coordination with our online guest support system, WhatsApp, Airbnb, direct booking. Innovation on increasing the guest satisfaction rate through best hospitality practice. Brand, improving the reputation, brand awareness, and book of Vista through positive words of mouth. Ownership and taking responsibility of uh, the outcome of your plans. Okay, so um, I'm motioning that we're gonna use the following metrics for D1's evaluation. Can I get a second? Okay, it's been seconded by Risky. Is there any further discussion? No? Okay, so uh, all in favor of using the following metrics for this promotion review, please vote in favor now. Okay, all right, so the metrics have been approved and we'll move on to the areas of responsibility. So, the areas of responsibility by D1 are, he's a host, primarily in Padang Padang and Uluwatu, and he also does revenue management for Padang Padang. Um, okay, can, let's see, D1, do you agree that these are your primary and secondary areas of responsibility? Yep. Okay, all right, great. Um, okay, so these are the areas we're gonna be looking in terms of your areas of responsibility. All right, promotion committee. Squad lead is Tendi, who is absent. Rafik, who is absent. Um, revenue management, Bayou, who's on the team. And me, Jing, the CEO. So the advisor committee will consist of Chandra and also Risky as well. So let's see. Uh, over to, okay, so I'm gonna motion. Uh, I'm motioning that this is the promotion committee. So the promotion committee will have the final decision on whether or not the promotion will happen or not, okay? The advisor committee is simply here to put extra evidence and collect more feedback so that we can see a little bit more clearly what's going on, okay? All right, so uh, I'm motioning this is the promotion advisory committee. All right, let's go with the promotion committee first. I motioned that the promotion committee is as stated with Tendi, Rafik, Bayou, and Jing. Can I get a second on that? You guys have a second by Rizal. Is there any further discussion? Further discussion? Okay, all right. So. All in favor of using this promotion committee, please vote in favor now. Okay, all right. Um, advisory committee, uh, this is Chandra and Risky. So I motion that this is advisory committee. Can I get a second on it? Okay, it's been seconded and all in favor, uh, is there any discussion? No, okay, all in favor of using this advisory committee, please vote in favor now. Okay, all right. So uh, D1, these are the metrics, these are their areas of responsibility and this is your promotion, this is your advisory committee. Let's go ahead and get this all started. So, um, first uh, set of information supporting evidence. Thank you, by the way, for applying. Okay, <laughs> so I have to remind a few times, but it's, it, I'm, I'm happy we're finally here. Um, no matter what the results are, I think feedback is always good, and it's better to ask um, for feedback just to know 
uh, where you stand in terms of where this is. Uh, a promotion review is a way for us to synchronize on core values and understand uh, your progress. Thank you very much, Rafik, for appearing. Um, let's see. You know, it was your recent anniversary. Yeah. yeah. Work yeah. anniversary. Yeah. So, so, so Andy, I think. Andy on, yeah, on software. Okay, all right. So, Andy, Andy. <laughs> all right, we, we really need to have HR remember work anniversaries and anniversaries. I, I believe Boohoo is working on it right now, so these um, will have better awareness. Let's, let's go to the first area. Um, Diwan, can you explain to us what we see here? So this is the requiring convert uh, conversion. Uh, yes, uh, exactly. The yes is asking uh, is that you can see here. Yes. Mm -hmm. So there's the query. So I uh, insert it uh, based on the listing and then the fact there, mm -hmm. the location and some. Uh, okay. And I send it to the approval and then. Uh, okay, got it. Great. Okay, let's take a look at the second one. Uh, yeah, I'm basically this one. This. Uh, yeah, it's like the same. Okay. Uh, this equation, uh, so this like this is about the room. Okay. Uh, and okay. And actually, this booking is from Bella. It's from in, in Feha. Mm -hmm. So he asking the the other room is it different or not? So I tell there's like two different rooms. So I uh, explain it. Mm -hmm. And Bella has booked like four, four rooms mm -hmm. uh, with the with different uh, with different reservation, right? Like, okay. Because they have a wedding with them. Understood. Okay. All right. Sounds good. All right. Let's go ahead and take a look at some other evidence here. All right. Do you want to tell us more about these? Yeah. This one is a uh, request. So I believe this with you and uh, especially we have. Mm -hmm. uh, ah. Okay. Yeah. All right. So this one, uh, the guest asking about. Uh, there is no availability in the room, mm -hmm. no body room, so I explained this by the suggestion of uh, other dates mm -hmm. or other properties in the house. Okay. So, okay. I guess uh, finally accept the meeting and then okay. for the change. Uh, okay, so guest requested a room that wasn't available and we found another room that was available and resold it. Yep. All right, next one. Another booking request. So, mm, Okay, all right. Interesting. So, this is a request for uh, alchemist. alchemist. Okay, all right. Alteration. Okay, all right. And next one. So, show us this. Oh yeah, this is the listing for yeah, this is the listing for two bedrooms. Okay. So the guest is actually uh, just two people. Mm -hmm. So uh, I like uh, suggest we move to just one room. Okay. And then the guest agree. Okay. Got it. Okay, interesting. All right, so there's a discussion here. I'm, I'm, uh, where does the thread begin? Does it start from the top? Uh, it starts from the bottom? Okay, and then goes up here. Okay, great. And then here, and then it continues here. Yeah? Okay, and then it was eventually conserved, uh, confirmed. Okay, great. And you were proactive about accepting the crush first. Okay. Oh, uh, interesting. All right, tell us more. Uh, what is this? So, this is about my account. Uh, uh, I've been with profile coverage. Uh -huh. So you can see the growth okay. from my beginning November okay. until August. Uh, ah. so it's uh, been a very season. Okay. So also, the request for the season is uh, uh, it's good. Uh, okay. About the SLT. So generally 50% for I know, but this. <laughs> the converter is the blue one. Yeah. Is conversion blue? Oh, oh, good, 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 good. Okay, good, 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 good. Converted. Yes. Okay, understood. Thank you. Wow. Okay, that's very good. 
So this is good. This is uh, it was a daily engine now is the one engine. So okay. I maintain the profile that there's no request. All right. Okay, fantastic. All right, so these are uh, the evidences that D1 has submitted for um, sales. Is there any discussion? D1, yep. what is the closest profile to Bayou Wayana that you do not manage right now? And we can take a look and make a parallel comparison to that. Um, it's not really into it. I mean, like, the profile. So, what would be the closest comparison profile to uh, Bayan Wayana? Bastian Wayana. Okay, let's go ahead and just take a look at that and see where we are. Uh, let's see. Uh, Bayu, what do you think? Good. Okay, Bastian Wayana. Okay, what about D1 and Jing? What's the closest uh, comparison profile we can take a look? 10 D1. 10 D1. No, that's really different. Mm -hmm. That is mostly in Ubudu. Oh, yeah. Okay. Any, anything else that's kind of close to D1 and, and Jing? Mm. Ah, okay, yeah, that, that yeah. seems right. Okay, all right, so let's go ahead and take a look at some of those. So we're looking, I guess, old BB stats. Um, I guess we can look at new BB stats and see what we're doing. But uh, we'll have to, okay, all right, let's see. Um, I guess we're going to use old, old, because that makes sense, right? Because if there's any data discrepancies, then they are, uh, I guess, equal on both sides. So let's go ahead and take a look at the profile revenue and see what we're doing on Bastion Wayana and, uh, and the other one. Okay, all right. So let's take a look. Uh, Bastion Wayana is here. So we'll go ahead and screenshot that, copy that in. And the other one is Chris. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is Chris and Wayana. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is we'll take that and we will stack it in a side-by-side -side comparison to the two properties that D1 covers currently. Okay, all right. Let's take a look and see what those look like. Okay, all right. So this is Bastion Wayana in comparison to Bayou and Wayana. Let me just shift this over here. And let me shift this over here. So we can get kind of like a side-by-side. Uh, all right. Okay. Okay. All right. So the two on the left not covered by MD1. So the point of this uh, comparison is just to see what the relative growth is uh, from month to month, and also see what the relative conversion rate is too as well. Okay. So on the one covered by um, D1, we started at about an eight, and the twenty-three it generally has okay down up. Mm, okay. So I have a progressive nature going up. Um, and this one also follows kind of a similar pathway, but is it the same? Ah, it's not the same uh, cut. All right, so we have to go back and cut it the same way so that it will look the same. Um, okay, so we have to delete this data over here and over here. November, yeah? Okay, let's go let's go to November. No filter. <laughs> All right, there's no filter anymore. Um, so, okay, uh, our visibility is a little bit limited now. So, let's look at where we do have the visibility and see what we can see from that point on. So, D1 happened starting from January. <laughs> okay, we'll assume that maybe D1 was training the first two months. Um, okay, so let's see what we can see across on the months that are relevant. Um, Okay, all right, so once again, uh, I guess we're, we're starting from January now. So January was it's sort of hard to see them side by side, but okay. When I'm track, hmm, how do I track this side by side? Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to look at this. Okay, I'm going to look at D1's January here and compare it to the January over on this side. So D1's January was 11, uh, this was 15. Then D1 actually showed some growth between January and February, whereas the other profile showed no growth from January to February. So D1 wins on the first iteration, yeah? Okay, let's go to the next one. 
The next one was from February to March. This one went up a little bit. This one on this one, uh, the other one went up a lot, right? So D1 went up about like, I think 1,000. The other one started at around the same mark, but went up quite a bit more. On the third month, so okay, that one is where this profile wins over D1s, right? So one, one score, one, one score above, one score below. The next one is from March to April. There is quite an increase. D1 has gone up actually far more, from 16 to 22 is bigger than from 19 to 23, yeah? Because this went up 6,000 over 16, this went up 3,000, 4,000 over 19. Make sense? Mm -hmm. So it's a bigger numerator over a smaller denominator. The other one is a, a, small, uh, is a smaller denominator over a smaller numerator, okay. All right, so, so D1 wins again on the growth over between those months. The next month, actually D1 wins again from April to May, in April to May, the corresponding profile goes down. D1s go up. Okay, and then on the next corresponding profile, it goes up, but D1s already ahead. So that one looks like another win. Uh, from June to July, bigger growth, actually. A higher peak at 33 versus 32. And then July to August is where D1's profile goes down, actually. It's only at, sorry, 23, and this one goes up quite a bit. The other thing D1 I can't see is what happened after August. Okay, yeah. so, so the screenshot is during August, right? So August is not complete, maybe. Oh, okay. So the question is, do you want... Oh, you started building this in August. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. all right. So... <laughs> Okay, now we're silver blind. All right, so we can only look up to about uh, be pre-August, I guess, right? Um, all right, let's take a look at the other one and see how we're doing. So January to January, D1 starts off uh, pretty high. And then, um, okay, so we're looking at January versus January. So this is 4,000, drops to 3,000. D1 drops less, right, proportionally than the other one. So the other one goes almost a half. D1 just drops about 25% from January to February. Up. Okay, on the February to March, D1 does actually less growth. His, his March is actually a drop, whereas on the other profile, it's a, a growth. And then the next month from March to April, March to April here goes up about 4,000 over 6,000. This is, okay, roughly the same. They're, they're both going up. And then the next month from April to May, D1 goes up a little bit faster than the corresponding profile, right? And then the next month it goes down. Um, D1 goes down a little bit more than the corresponding profile. The corresponding profile went down a little bit. D1 has went down quite a bit. And then now from June to July, uh, it went up quite a lot on the other profile, almost 70%. D1s did not win. And then from July to August, it went up quite a bit. Okay, so okay, so some wins, some victories, but overall I would say this one probably performed better than this one. On the Bayou, performed better than Bastiwana. This one definitely looks like Chris and Wyatt is performing a bit better. Uh, more steady and also higher amounts of growth. Okay, all right, so, okay, all right, interesting. Any more discussion about the sales in terms of uh, how D1's doing? Nope, okay, all right, let's continue. Oh, yes, Tendi. Wayana, uh, since from I think June on July because the uh, Kumbangko pudding is already starting for the using Tokyo. There's also some new property on the Chris and Wayana and then D1 engine there is no new property. So that's why the the, the growth is more different. Ah, okay, understood. Okay, all right. Thank you. Thank you, Teddy, for illustrating that point. Okay, so Teddy brings up the point that essentially there have been more uh, new properties added to the Chris and Wayana. And that could be essentially what's adding to the growth, right? Uh, whereas the D1 and Jing has stayed relatively flat in terms of the total number of properties on it. Okay, um, well considered. Thank you very much for offering that uh, evidence, Tendi. Okay, any more discussion? Okay, all right, good. Let's continue. Teamwork, um, D1, speak on this. So this one is like, uh, uh, there's a case uh, about the Yes, it's missing, miss, uh, lost the motorbike. Mm -hmm. So, actually, Gabriel uh, is uh, like it off, uh, off, I forgot. So, Pak Raka is calling Gabriel and then ask me when I, uh, well, at the time I was in uh, 
me so get the information like that so I jump in and find the solution discussion about uh, with the Karai how how should be done and uh, what is the solution so after I think the, the discussion okay. uh, so, yeah uh, I have an update from the, give them update uh, to the other team about the case so it should be uh, report to the police station and then but the police station uh, say the police state that should be like three days, uh, three days notice that the bike is not back, and we can make a report. So I tell the guest like uh, for the conversation, everything. The guest, exactly the guest check out like two days uh, later, mm -hmm. and uh, I discuss with him and then decided to extend like two days more for the to complete this. Case. Okay, got it. Um, actually, not too clear still. So, what what exactly happened? The uh, okay. Does does anybody else have any any knowledge about this case? Okay, to Rafik. Rafik. Yeah, uh, this case is a little bit complicated. So. So, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's, uh, the first one is uh, the the guest is drunk and then he bring uh, the motorcycle. Okay, guest drunk. And then. Yeah, and the motorcycle, and then the guests didn't bring back the motorcycle to. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. And then uh, Gabriel is reported by the staff. Okay. The the, the what is called the guests didn't bring back the motorcycle, right? Okay. And then the next day is the one going there to follow up with the guests. Okay. So what happened? Uh, what is your responsibility about this? And and the guest is cooperated and you want to take him to the police office to report and everything and then he just report to me uh i hope he's already report to police blah 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 and then we get uh must be three days after the uh, motorcycle is uh gone and then the next day i go there and the gas is checking out and then i talk with the guest and then the guest is already talk with the one he said Okay, I will uh, responsibility at least three days. If you didn't find the motorcycle, I will pay. That is the that is the one said to the guest, and the guest is agree about that. And then, and three days, four days, we waiting, and then someone is coming with the motorcycle, yeah. and then Paraka is uh, give hundred thousand to the person the security of uh, Aston, bring the scooter. And then I contact the guest. Uh, I bro, the, the, the scooter I've been found. Thank you for so, thank you so much. And then he give a good review. Wow, wow. that yeah. sounds really complex. Yeah, you're right. So the guest yeah. got drunk, lost the motorbike, and then came yes. back. And then we had to step on him to to make sure that he would pay for the lost motorbike. But the motorbike was found. Yes. So, but the point is like this, sir. The mm -hmm. point is, uh, the one talk with the guest. Mm -hmm. And about the uh, the losing of motorcycle, and the guest is agree for for mm, payment pay, okay. payment for the motorcycle. Okay, but thanks God, the motorcycle, motorcycle is found. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Dion, for that. That sounds pretty amazing. Um, all right. Tell us more what this is about. So this one. So um, this one is a. Uh, Uber booking mm -hmm. in uh, Ubis, mm -hmm. Bayu and Wayana. So it's about the uh, problem in Bayu Wayana before. Okay. So I found this and then I tell Tendi like, Ten, uh, Tendi, uh, so this is Obe. Can I just, I just ask him Tendi, to ajak me like, ajak me to this case. I will okay. solve this. Thing. Okay, and thank you. The guess is Fantastic. Oh, okay, great. Bobby's this bus seat. Okay, so this is it, yeah? Yeah. All right, same guest? Different yes, yes, yes. Okay, all right. Great. Uh, fantastic. Okay, all right. Let's go to team feedback. Go ahead. Yeah, this is uh, the team feedback. So I've got uh, core value recognition. I've got the first from Tendi. Uh, from Bayou, they want to have another team member addressing all patients for the reservation. Mm -hmm. And then from Tendi, uh, they want to have more. Maybe it's as 
Okay. Oh, sorry, sorry, excuse me. Yeah, over here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, all right, great. Um, let's take a look at this. What's this? Yeah, this is uh, for uh, satisfaction survey. Okay. So, we just have to create a couple of things. So, someone just running. Yep. Okay. Okay. Great, fantastic. All right. Great, fantastic. Okay, so that that is the evidence for teamwork. Any further discussion on this? Okay, all right. If there's no further discussion, then we'll move on. Let's go to the next subject, which is about hospitality. Yeah. Hospitality, let's go. It's about uh, the guest is in another queue. Mm -hmm. So we can see. Yep, yep. Put on, put on view. Yeah. Okay. And the so this one is like a bit our repeater mm -hmm. in Changu. Mm -hmm. uh, the room has uh, had been uh, in, uh, in Kapol. Uh -huh. So Kapol is fully booked. And then he moved to Kamala Abu instead. Sounds very uh, happy. Okay, all right. Great. And this one, uh, it's like no mention of my name. So, but I remember him, Rafael and family. Uh -huh. So he stayed in Puri Kelapa. So he booked two rooms. Mm -hmm. But, uh, he is likely with just one room. So he is very confused about the alteration and something. So I think that he have uh, the best uh, to solve the problem. So he, they, they just don't spend uh, the money for two rooms, just one room. So, okay. the, refund. so the owner also said it's okay. okay. And then I have it. And then he very good. Ask the people. So this one this is Philippa. Uh, exactly. Can see the scooter to rent for cheap, mm -hmm. and we go to. So we got a flat. So the guest is uh, stuck by the, by the motorbike, mm -hmm. so they cannot come back. Mm -hmm. So I go to the staff to pick up the mm -hmm. uh, to give them the new motorbike. Okay, fantastic. Very good. This one is uh, mentioned. Mm -hmm. This device. This goes into the hospitality index. Is there any further discussion on this? Okay, all right, no further discussion, let's move on. On communication, okay, so, uh, right. Why is this review positive? <laughs> Okay, all right. Good communication. <laughs> Bad stay. All right. Well, let's go on to the next one. Go ahead. This is like the same case. Mm -hmm. uh, train in uh, train in Kera. Mm -hmm. I like basically the response is like uh, maybe I I don't remember I met train or not. I asked on WhatsApp or email. Mm -hmm. Okay. You get the Okay. Same Simplish. Martina, yeah? Okay. All right. Communication. And uh, what are these? This one, like, uh, if someone, like, you know, I'm going around, mm -hmm. uh, with a bike, and then if someone called, and then uh, I cannot uh, hang up the phone. So I decided to, like, call back and I get not wait for the call someone. I don't know how to So the timestamp is not too late, but the thing is for two. Your air support, too? No. I, I support you calling me. Oh, so there's no response. So yeah. I can't. <laughs> okay. All right. That's funny. <laughs> oh, that's new. That's new. I haven't seen anybody use this yet. Okay. All right. Interesting. Okay. Got it. Got it. All right. Um, okay. So, okay. You call back quickly. Okay. On innovation. Yep. I remember this. Yeah. So, I uh, exactly. Uh, I'm with I with ND bring up the best practice for like new knowledge and then new best practice for like checking guests, mm -hmm. especially in Pila. So we make a workshop about the uh, service, it's like the uh, remote service. Mm -hmm. When it, uh, the service is usually using it just in a luxury hotel. Okay, got it. Okay, yep. Um, okay, oh, sorry. We just went past communication. 
Is there any further discussion about uh, do you want some communication? No? Okay. All right. And we just looked at the innovation. Any further discussion about innovation? Okay. All right. Let's, maybe, yes? Maybe I'll ask about that. Uh, how, uh, how much are we are using this? <laughs> Actually, I, I use it in uh, almost uh, I always use it when uh, the arrival late to Kilakama. So for me, it, uh, it's best practice for me. So I share it, uh, but I don't know how is the director get the, the workshop. Okay. All right. Any further questions, Blake? Okay. All right. Interesting. Okay. Any further discussion about innovation? Okay. All right. Uh, let's talk about ownership. Ownership. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's this? Oh, wait. No, okay. This is the same part. Okay. Uh, go ahead and tell us about this, D1. So, this one is uh, I do the, um, join the internal open source. Mm, good. So, it's like misleading information about the system. Mm -hmm. It's the same as Nakama. So, exactly, it's more information about the description about the number of rooms. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's like two types of villas in Villa Kama. This one is a uh, two bedroom villa and then three bedroom villa. Mm -hmm. And the field, this one is Villa 2. Exactly. Okay. It's uh, Villa 3. It's like you only has two bedroom villas. And then mm -hmm. I check the information. The information I mean, like, in the description, it's wrong. But in okay. uh, I mean, it's just the. Uh, okay. All right. Cool. Um, oops. Uh, let's go to the next piece of evidence here, which is over here. So this one was, um, this one is like, I'm making a content request for content in my area, which is uh, mm -hmm. about the uh, photos in the uh, booking of this day. Okay. So there's like uh, upgrade, photo upgrade in the listing, but uh, in the booking of home, like past one month or two months, there is no change. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Interesting. Okay. All right. Good. 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 And then what's this? This one is uh, the partnership PRM. Uh, mm -hmm. So I uh, be a member of the club because I do the field management. Usually I update all my activities. Okay. All right. Uh, interesting. And uh, this is same. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Wow. Nice. Okay. All right. Let's. Uh, is there any more discussion about ownership on D1's part? Okay. Question. Yes, go ahead. Bye. Uh, why, uh, why do you consider this as uh, in the ownership instead of uh, process involvement? Which one? Uh, this one, this, uh, uh, this activity, uh, internal open source and also updating the PRM. Uh, why it, it belongs to the ownership uh, topics instead of uh, process uh, involvement? So, uh, I decided to this, um, this topic because of um, process involvement uh, for the host. I think it's hard to get uh, evidence like hosting, doing the hosting, maybe uh, what can I put in here? Like, how uh, so this one exactly. Uh, I do uh, responsibilities in my area, like to improve and then to maintain my area running smoothly. Mm, okay. Uh, maybe because no one else do that. Yeah. So, <laughs> so you have to do that yourself. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting point, though. Yeah. Okay. Because what what's your take on this, by you? Uh, yeah. Uh, for, uh, for me. Uh, the way I see it, actually, this is uh, just a, a process, basically, a process that are already there, and, and actually, everyone should, should do this. So, uh, uh, everyone should, uh, basically, by, by default, it's, uh, this is actually the process. So, uh, uh, for me, uh, at least, uh, ownership is that you you know that uh, you care better than, than other, other people. Mm. So, if, if if there's no one do it, then you say, oh, or actually it should be me that uh, does this uh, 
whether it will be successful or be a failure. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. okay, so basic responsibility versus above and beyond responsibility. Yeah. Okay, all right. Point noted. Uh, okay, all right. Let's. Uh, is there any further discussion about this? No. Okay. Let's start with uh, Risky's feedback first, and then we'll let Risky go. Okay. So, uh, uh, thank you, Risky, for, for staying over past normal hours again. And thank you, everybody, for staying past normal hours again. All right. Let's take a look at what Risky has to say. For sales, do you want to understand how to do cross selling as one on the night shift squad where he has the knowledge of property from squad one, two, three, four? Great. For teamwork, uh, Newman is quite a flexible guy on the team, can adopt to the new culture of the project that is assigned to him. Yep. Hospitality is a great relationship with owners and Uluwatu and Padang Padang. Great. Communication is communication skills very reliable when it comes to special case reporting and finance. Great. Innovation workshop turn down service. Do the workshop again, D1. Okay. Brand. He's already the face of Bukit Vista and Padang Padang and Uluwatu. Great. Ownership by doing revenue management is shown he has the ownership of this company. Okay. Interesting. Helpful advice to D1. Speak up and be more proactive. One. I assume that's Matt, right? Uh, one. One. Oh, one. Oh, D1 as a D1. Okay. Uh, and also bring more ideas, best practice, and innovations to the company. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, Risky. Um, do you, is there anything else you'd like to say, Risky, before we... Uh, we're just maybe adding some more. Okay. Uh, I mean, D1 is going to be uh, not too confident of his uh, capacity or capability. And maybe this is the right company for you uh, <laughs> to grow because we all have uh, we all provide the what is that called the material I guess I mean you can uh, bring new idea or anything to this company and I mean I believe you have many more ideas right to uh, way to improve this uh, especially on those so maybe you can be more confident to uh, maybe step up and maybe do a championing project, your own project. Okay. All right. Great advice, Risky. Thank you very much for that. Okay. All right. That's pretty much it. Do you want to, do you have anything to say to Risky? Okay. All right. Fantastic. All right. Risky, <laughs> we'll let you go home. All right. Uh, thank you for advising. Okay. Let's take a look at the next person. The next person is Chandra. Thank you very much, Risky. All right, next person is Chandra. Chandra said on sales, D1 is very helpful in converting the increase of bookings. He was out of the property and covering all squads, and he understands very well on cross selling. Teamwork. Uh, he is very flexible on covering everyone's beats on squad two. Most of the time, he takes initiative. If there's issue on squad two, like overbooking, gets complaint. Great. Uh, hospitality. He's cheerful and very hospitable, especially to owners in Padang Padang Uwatu. I saw many times how owners trust D1 to become someone very reliable in the area. Good. Uh, communication is very easy to be reached, is fast in reply, especially when I need back from the field. Innovation, no. Uh, Brad, the video he made with Ghani is interesting. It could be the one of the way to increase brand awareness of Book of Vista. This is the recent one with with the uh, yeah. the host introduction area that you you and Tendi both made one, right? Yeah. Uh, Putakalapa and uh, the, okay, all right, another one is at La Bombay. All right, ownership, he's taking responsibility for revenue management very well. Also look up to him on this subject. Helpful advice for review one, please do reduce Magur! <laughs> yeah, Malaskara. Yeah. Magur Anya. Yeah. Happy face. Okay. All right. So that's the advisor committee. Thank you, Chandra, for our advising. And let's go on to Bayi's evaluation. Okay. So Bayi's evaluation says that D1 on sales takes responsibility and cares about the performance of the properties in his area. This indirectly leads to better sales by finding leaks and improving pricing awareness. Direct contribution to sales is by covering reservation and convert into bookings. Okay, so teamwork. He contributes by doing night shift and hosting duties, coordinates with other chapters and reports issues to be fixed. Hospitality, D1 is easygoing and hospitable as a teammate. Uh, I don't have any visibility for guest uh, hospitality. On communication, easy to reach, getting back timely. Improvement area on indirect communication. Update the PRM, comment on guest issues on bigger for night shift and finance issue, contributing on paper discussions on chapter and squad. Okay, areas where communication could improve. Uh, innovation, none that I uh, could, none that I see that can improve our hospitality value. His main role is hosting a Padang Padang area, which does not have so many properties. Uh, this could be an opportunity to do experiments and try to give exceptional hospitality experience that other hosts can follow. Okay, uh, Brad, none that I noticed. Could be improved by involved in Padang Padang Uluwatu community to make Bukit Vista included in the conversation for any community yet or any new development. 
knowing people in the community like restaurant owners, community leaders, or other property owners. Uh, I don't think the hosting video is d ones initiative, am I right? d who's who decided to make the hosting video? Content. Okay. Okay, got it. All right. And <laughs> so I do it like Windows I believe it was Rezal's initiative, right? For yeah. the host. Okay, template. All right. All right. On ownership, he takes responsibility for regular duties and role, but I haven't seen action beyond that. So area of improvement. Define your vision on how hosting in Padang, Padang, and Uluwatu should be. And define your vision on how revenue management should be. Coordinate with other chapters to achieve that vision and share the experience of managing these two roles. Show success and failure to other team and seek the mentor that you need. Hmm. Okay. Helpful advice for Diwan, please attach previous promotion review and see if the points of improvement have been achieved. Diwan, have you actually applied for a promotion review ever? Not yet. So this is the very oh. first time. Oh, yeah? Okay. This is the very first time ever right. so <laughs> in a year. The first, the first uh, the, uh, promotion like from Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. It's like uh, the Yeah. Yeah. So we just said we just said okay, you're not on probation anymore because yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was before we actually had formalized processes for promotion. So uh, those kicked in about I think the first person was who? Who's the first? What? Okay. Who was the first person to have a promotion? Risky, right? Was it risky? Putri. Put <laughs> Really? Yeah, it was one of the first. One of the first. One of the first. Yeah. Okay. One of the first was Uti. Yeah. Uh, and I think before that, somebody else. All right. Let's go to Rafik. Rafik on sales says, uh, do you want is helping covering a few accounts like DJ and BW and sometimes any account that didn't cover by the team who's taking a day off? He joins in the night duty shift as well and gives alternate to other guests or overbooking guests. Teamwork is flexible day off and being Teddy Buddy here. On hospitality, I saw a guy a few mentions from a review and helps guests on site, but I like D1 because he not only helped our guests on Airbnb, but helped the owner's guests as well, and that's plus for partner relationship. Uh, on communication is reliable, even though after working hours and innovation, he makes the workshop turn down service and referred to Tendi comment above. On brand, he makes video for Ghani, and I saw it. It's very interesting. And good relationship between him and the owner, especially in the Phnom Penh area. On helpful advice for D1, please join more guild and meeting like hospitality and community. All right, great. Okay, and then uh, first evaluator actually is Tendi. Okay, so Tendi says on sales, do you want to help and take care of reservation? What? This is like copy paste, right? Okay, do you want to help and take care of reservation for your VW and DJL? Also taking, uh, okay, all right, all profile for next shift. He also gave some alternative property for properties that are not available. Timor, do you want to help cover my beat for hosting revenues? He's also flexible to change the day off depending upon the situation. Okay. Uh, hospitality had good relation with the owner in Padang Padang and also Uluwatu with the guest. He has recommendation place and information about the area for the guest. On communication is reliable and when I need help for urgent situation and reachable. Um, on innovation, he makes voucher gift for a workshop at STP. Voucher gift for workshop at STP. Uh, the property. Oh, right. Okay. Right, right, right. The, the workshop that we did last uh, September, right? Okay. All right. And also improved the previous maps at Uluwatu. Okay. He also made a video with uh, Gunny about hosting guests from BB and uploading it to YouTube. Takes care of the revenue in Padang Padang. Got higher revenue than last year. Yes. Okay. And helpful advance uh, to the D1. Learn to be community manager in uh, Padang Padang and Uluwatu area. Okay. This is... Uh, this is Jink. Okay, so I'm the last one on here. So, okay, I'll start with this because I think this is important. Uh, D1, I see your name a lot <laughs> on the reservation boards for uh, for the the animals, right? Uh, so your name shows up a lot on when we do reservation guilt, and it shows up for unconverted or not answering inquiries. This is an example from Double D, and. Um, these are happening also at all times of hours. This is, of course, in the evening. Um, once again, this is a double D inquiry, and we have not answered what is the walking distance to the beach. And previously, this is another one where he's asking, do you have a more quiet room, um, and we need a big bed, is it the same place? So these are cases where content has spotted. Um, essentially incomplete uh, inquiries. So, so I think that part needs to have a little bit more care and attention. And I think that would help. 
like Tendi said, if you actually join the guild, um, you would be able to see that uh, that these things are happening, right? Um, once again, this is another example of inquiries not being answered. Um, how can we be sure that we are? Uh, we're wondering what the chamber we would have there just in front of the amazing view. How can we be sure that it's the one that we get? And there is no uh, answer to that specific question. So uh, be sure to answer the guest question. Otherwise, it does feel like you're sending template answers to the guest. Okay. Um, in some cases, there have been no responses to as well, and uh, this appears a few times. Um, this one was really hard to read, so I, I label it as communication. It, communication is so much more than just about what we signal, but it's also context. Uh, this is your promotion review, so uh, we need to have clear communication here, right? And we need to be able to read what you've written down and be uh, unambiguous about what you're trying to communicate. Um, it is not just what we say or what we text, but it's also what we write down, because what we write down will be read by many people, hopefully, in the future, um, including at your promotion review. So, okay, um, no worries, I'm just giving you some feedback, right? Oh, so, oh, that jumped up all the way to the top already. All right, so on sales, uh, yes, D1, I see you have skills. You do have skills and you do convert, and as everyone has said, you convert inquiries from uh, situations that are not, not very uh, stable to a confirmed booking. So this part is good. Um, I think you have a lot more to learn in reservation skills, and I would love to see you more at the reservation kill in order to grow, right? Um, this is about uh, a growth mindset. And so um, you, this part needs to be visible. So once again, not answering guest inquiries and having a good grip on being able to tell the guess what is going on in the area is important. So, so this part is key. This is currently a leak in the reservation process. Okay, um, for teamwork, I defer to your teammates on the information. And what I see is this: I think you're a strong, silent. Uh, how would I say, uh, teammate? And you are a pillar. So you're kind of like the structure that holds up the building. It it is quiet. It doesn't speak for itself. But if you remove it, then it's not there and the effect is shown. So in that particular regard, I think that's really good. Uh, that is the type of teamwork that I really appreciate. And uh, I think your teammates have told you that already and I see that. Okay, on hospitality, I do see some names mentioning, I do see some times where you're, you're mentioned, but you've been here for a year, sir. <laughs> you've been here for a year. And I don't have too much visibility, but I would expect uh, more mentions and more development in terms of hospitality here. So in terms of your position, I, I, I agree with you. You are in an area where sometimes there is, I think, a lot of opportunity. There's not a lot of check-ins, right? Um, turndown service is something that you're implementing. But has turndown service actually been recognized by the guests? Have they actually come back and said, hey, look, turndown service is excellent. Whoever did this, fantastic. And I think it's about hospitality and innovation. So if it doesn't work or you don't think it's getting the right traction, what are you going to do next? How are you going to be more hospitable? So this is an opportunity, and we need to see you um, really think um, in, a, in a creative way, right? Uh, in a supportive way where you can say, hey, Jing, hey, uh, Rafik, you know, I've noticed these things are not right. Can I actually ask for this? Can I ask for tools? It's, not, it's okay. Like, let's say in Tendi's case for the, um, I forgot what that was, but there was an iPad check-in that we moved around, right? Um, try things like that on your own initiative, right? It doesn't matter if the results aren't working, but learn to pivot and learn to continue that hospitality innovation. That's where we need to really see strength in, all right? Uh, leading with the, like, like Buddy has put down, a vision, a vision. What does excellent hospitality look like? Um, rather than just reacting to overbookings, right? Um, that, that's okay, but uh, if you are getting into senior role, more projects, more competency, more more forms of excellence. And this is where I kind of want to direct our attention to the career matrix, right? So if we're talking about more senior roles, we do need to see that you are process involved, but also process competent, that you're project involved, that you're leadership involved, that you're leadership competent. And these are important things to touch upon. Okay, so, so that's what I'm looking for here. Um, I don't know you very well, sir. <laughs> I don't know you very well. Like, like we're strangers a lot. Uh, I see you around, and, and, and I don't know, maybe I don't speak Balinese, and maybe you're starting to speak English. 
But for whatever it is, uh, I haven't really connected with you. Um, so I don't really know very much about you as a person. Uh, it's not, it's not, it doesn't go against you, right? Like, I, I don't mind. You could do great work here and not know me at all. I would still promote you. But I just don't know visibility uh, in terms of your communication skills. So um, I just really have to ask your teammates to, to uh, share that information with me, okay, about communication. Um, on innovation, I think it's mostly how can you get a vision together, right? And it is a lean, agile iteration cycle. So how can you put together, like, all right, this is what I want. Like, essentially, let's say, for example, turn down service. Turn down service, I would say, is not an innovation yet. Because like we've put together, it hasn't been socialized yet, right? Uh, we haven't actually distributed this idea. Um, and a project isn't really successful if we just do it kind of ourselves and such, and we're not actually using it to, to make a fact. Uh, if bigger was only used here between Bayou and us, it wouldn't be as effective as if it's being rolled out and being used by the entire community. If uh, review management, right? Like before, Yvonne was the only person who used it. Yvonne's not here anymore, so it's not really, not really useful. So when you think of like a project innovation, it cannot stop at like I just made this. It has to actually be deployed, and you have to then look at what the results are and then consider, because innovation doesn't stop. Innovation is never settle. It is a continuous process to refine, refine, refine. So how can you get this vision together and then persistence to continue um, innovating? So never settle. And in this particular regard, um, we in a year have seen one attempt on the turndown service and not continuous attempts, right? So, so definitely think about that. Uh, on Brad, uh, I think you've been doing great, right? Uh, the owners seem to be very happy. We see rising revenue. But once again, I just don't have any evidence because we don't have any of our owner surveys, right? <laughs> and we're getting no owner surveys yet to this day being filled out. So I like to think that it's happening, but I would prefer if the owners actually write on the survey. And if you have a survey that I haven't seen, please show me. But I would prefer to see surveys from, let's say, all the owners at Uluwatu saying, hey, he was great. If he wasn't here, things would be a mess, right? And that way, it's not just we all believe it, but it's actually the owners uh, believe it too. And, and ultimately, we're serving them. Okay, so on brand, uh, it seems like on the surface, everything's cool. Uh, you have a very relaxed relationship at Purikalapa, so I would assume that they feel very comfortable with you there, and that's evidenced in... Uh, in, in your video and, uh, and in other, other dimensions. But uh, the data is something that I really would like to see, right, in terms of understanding that. Um, I think you're a strong team player. I really do. I think you do essentially care about your team. You care about making your teammates um, whole. And uh, I know that you're alone in Uluwatu on high check-in days. And I know that you're alone here on night shift two as well. And so these things I see as being that you are committed to, to uh, bringing together. Here's some helpful advice that, that I've noticed, right? Um, some of the evidence that you brought here um, are kind of like meh, I would say, right? Meaning that, yeah, uh, responding when somebody calls you is kind of like what we should just naturally do. Um, bring that as a, a sort of applying for like a senior demonstration of, of communication skills and, and just two two cases of that I think is uh, I think a better way a better way do you want would just be to ask your teammates hey rate me on a scale of one to five on how many times you could reach me within five minutes or ten minutes right and then that would be more conclusive than just two sample sets of hey I was able to respond this time I was able to respond that time right so some of the evidence I think is is the it's essentially like um, it's understated, um, but I also know that you probably have done things that you're not reporting either, right? So I feel like there could be missing evidence that supports uh, strength, okay? Um, my helpful advice for the moment is this. I think, um, I think you have a lot of will. You have a lot of power. You have a lot of determination, but... There's, there's just no clear focus on what, what you really want to do or why you're really here. I think you, you love your teammates, you have this bond, but what is your vision? 
right? And the vision is so important to have that autonomy. And I think you, you work pretty good, but if I'm not mistaken, it's mostly responsive. It's, it's like you're responding to external circumstances and such. And I think the next level we're looking for is being proactive. Like if there are problems, how can we stop these problems before they happen? If there are issues, how can we like, like how can we turn these issues into opportunities? And so far it is, let's say, I think you're operationally good, but you need to invest some time for how am I gonna get better at doing this? And that is guided by being in guilds, learning all the different branches of hospitality, and I think showing your, your resolve that you want to, to step up. Um, and I've asked you to apply, 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 apply many times, right? So that I could give you this advice earlier. Um, but we're finally here at this moment, and I think this is an important moment because uh, we finally got this chance to actually tell Vimon, you know, what this advice looks like and give give that that feedback. So in terms of my most helpful advice, I would say think of a way where you can be an inspiration. We've got new hosts coming in, right? we got new hosts coming in, they're gonna be looking at you. They're gonna be looking at you to see, hey, this is what I'm gonna do. And if, if this doesn't inspire other people, right? If this makes other people go, well, okay, is that it? Then it means we're not doing good enough. If Uluwatu isn't one of the most desirable places for our guests to visit, and our properties aren't like, wow, you know, the hospitality here is just, is just amazing. Uh, you know, I, I, I saw all these things, he went, you know, did all this, and he organized these things for me. Yeah. Um, that would be the next level. So definitely have a vision. I think Bayou's advice is very on point about the vision of, of how to do it. My advice would be invest. Invest a bit of your time to learn how to do the next thing. Invest a bit of your time to to uh, to grow, so that our game can be the higher level game. Okay. okay. All right. Do you want? You're gonna have to step out, and we're gonna have to talk. So sure. when you come back, we'll tell you what we uh, what we right. decide. Okay. And then you can watch the video afterwards. Ooh. Okay. All right. Let's go to the but next. You want them to tell we'll say happy. We'll say happy. <laughs> okay. All right, let's open up the discussion. Over to, uh, let's see, let's go to Tendi first. Tendi, what's your call? Okay, yeah. what, do you, what do you think um, in terms of how this has gone? What would you give, do you want a pass to a senior host or, or just, just speak in the most open way possible? Yeah, I think uh, I will pass him. Mm -hmm. uh, the first thing that I see from him, maybe because uh, I still like, um, like a not like a fully delegate in my area, mm -hmm. so uh, he like a, he can like um, four to sixty with me. So sometimes I strip covering, sometimes not. But uh, since the expense of Changu, uh, I I try to, uh, to delegate all the things in Uluwatu like revenue, ownership, and community and everything. Mm -hmm. So. I think uh, the one will be like uh, independency, independent to to give the innovation and, and ownership and relationship and everything. So I will like uh, uh, release a lot from my bid. So uh, maybe uh, the one can like more more like expression the Uluwatu. Okay, got it. Okay, so Tendi is basically hoping that D1 will be able to operate Uluwatu independently as a senior host, and so he can be your delegate there. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Great. Fantastic. Let's go to Rafik. Rafik, what do you think? Uh, okay. Thank you. Uh, I think I, 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 will, I, think I will pass him mm -hmm. uh, because uh, I have a three point for uh, for Braun. First, he was strong. Mm -hmm. He was strong, and why I said he's strong because he was the person I know it beside Tendi step on toes mm -hmm. because. Before only me, Candy, and Chris was an achieve. Mm -hmm. So he was an initiative. I will do next it. So he said to do that and step on toes and then asking many times, but until now, he's not asking many as the first uh, mm -hmm. achieve. That is the first one. The second one uh, knows the areas. Mm -hmm. Knows the area. Even though we are rolling, like me and Candy going to Luato or Candy go. Up and I am doing. Uh, I support D1 is going to Django. As everyone know D1 as a host, mm -hmm. so Luatu and Palapadang as well. 
Then uh, the third one is uh, he was reliable, sir. and he know what he doing. The, the 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 mention of that is, for example, we have a case. For example, we have a case that uh, at Padang Padang or Uluwatu that uh, uh, Diwan handle. And if we asking Diwan, Diwan, how about this case? He know it. Mm, okay. And Got he it. know it very uh, quickly. Uh, okay, uh, I will talk with the owner, and the owner agree to give him. So it's not like uh, 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 that anymore. Mm, Even though okay. like uh, at Changu, I really appreciate it when when the guest is uh, losing the motorbike. It's uh, really good. But the count is uh, only once. I think it's uh, the one need more guilt, more learn from us, like uh, 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 what is called uh, hospitality guilt, and, uh, reservation guilt. Like that. I'm not sure what what is uh, is uh, what is called what is uh, the the point of the one why we cannot join <laughs> I, i'm not sure because it's, i think it's uh this is the timing management mm. the timing management how how, how is the uh, one uh, managing his time maybe he was on that seat after that he, he cannot uh, wake up maybe uh, for the, the because me, Tendi, and the one is always uh, okay. I take the uh, next seat, okay. And we are the three musketeers, so, so if uh, Tendi is off, the uh, one take next seat for one day, and then I take so two days. Yeah, is okay. That Got is it. only the, the, the only cons for me. For the okay. ones. Got it. Yeah. Um, we do record the meetings, so we could actually just watch them if he couldn't actually show up live, right? So, yeah. okay, all right. Thank you very much, Rafik. Appreciate that. Let's yeah. go to Bai. Yeah. Bai, what's your thoughts? Uh, for me, actually, I, I would like to see from from another side, actually. So, uh, the question is, uh, because B1 is applying for the senior uh, senior host, so what kind of senior host that we want, actually? So, uh, uh, for me, I think senior host should be uh, able to uh, show uh, Example for for the for the newer uh, or the ju uh, junior host basically, uh, and and setting the expectation that what what should uh, what should the host uh, do actually. Mm. So I think the setting the ex expectation by uh, giving an, an example that that uh, should be the standard of uh, being the se uh, senior person, right? So uh, uh, I haven't seen that uh, seen especially in terms of uh, mentoring, uh, uh, like uh, sharing or even uh, criticizing of how, how we are doing hospitality, for example. So the one uh, do actually uh, is in involvement. Uh, he involved in, in, uh, in the process, uh, also in, in the project, uh, well, less in the project actually. Uh, uh, also, yeah, basically, uh, what we need as a as a senior person, I think I think uh, he needs to have a competency, uh, know uh, what is wrong and, and what is right, uh, and then even even know what is what he what, what is he's doing wrong. So I think that that is important to to make sure that the next people uh, after him uh, could deliver better value than uh, than just uh, uh, only only following that. Okay. So. Uh, and this is this is pretty important. Uh, actually, yeah, uh, this is my my most uh, important uh, uh, concern. Actually, uh, so basically, uh, when when uh, when Teddy still cover Uluwatu, the uh, one's bit is only in Padang Padang. So uh, it, it cannot be compared. It's not even half of the Uluwatu. So I think the uh, one have a lot of time, uh, a lot of opportunity, uh, and have. Uh, 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 what do you call it? Uh, amazing property that does uh, really well uh, in Despacito, especially uh, the the staff is is helpful and everything is is, is set up good. So uh, I think there should be something that he can do uh, uh, in that uh, in, in with that opportunity to to deliver like at least at least uh, Padang Padang is the best uh, area the area with the best hospitality. I think uh, that. That should be, and that, that is my expectation of having a senior uh, host, actually. Okay. So uh, for, for me, it's uh, uh, 
uh, it's a no pass. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, Bayer. Um, okay. Let me also uh, speak now. So I've seen both sides, and I would say this. Um, I think D1 is in a comfort zone area. So very much so. He. I mean, I've had to ask him uh, three to four times, please apply, please apply, please apply for a promotion review. And for the longest time, I couldn't understand why he wouldn't just apply. So I do see that essentially, I think, yes, I think Bayou's spot on. He is strong in all the dimensions of involvement. He is process involvement strong. He is project involvement I'm actually not sure. I'm not. I think he, he follows in some projects. I don't know. Like, has he been involved in any project? Revenue management is kind of a project, right? Mm, could be. Actually, okay. that's a process. Okay, that's a yeah. process now. All right. So he is very very tall in involvement. He's very very tall. But on competency, this part I don't remember. I don't see the same amount of competencies in dealing with let's say sudden situations as I saw in Rafik and I saw in Tendi's development early on when you guys became seniors. So in the aspect of becoming a senior person, I think it is, yes, it is we have to say this is a person who other people want to follow, right? And this is a person who other people can follow. And we feel safe that if you follow this person, you are also going to develop well as a host. And in Dion's case, I would say I see very strong, let's say, characteristics of, yes, he's a very good follower, but can he actually be here? Can he actually lead any group of person? Does anybody seek D1 as being a mentor right now? And so in that particular dimension, we go back up to here where we agreed that we need LC and we need PCC uh, competency. We need process competency. We need leadership competency if we're going to give it to a senior person. I do believe this. I believe D1 has been undervalued, perhaps, because he's been staying on... A, a pay from, let's say, from very, very long time as just after probation. And I thought that was kind of ridiculous because I kept on asking him, please, please apply for a promotion, but he kept on delaying it. So is he at, let's say, the same page as promotion, as, as finishing probation? Clearly not. I think he's, he's a little bit progressed past that. But is he a senior host? Is he a person that I would comfortably, let's say, delegate, look after Joshua and make Joshua into something that is remarkable? Um, I don't know about that. I don't know about that because I don't know if that process excellence. So in this particular regard, I think it's dangerous. I don't see the same amount of, let's say, seriousness that Rafik showed when he stepped up and he handled crises single-handedly. I saw Tendi do the same. If you guys are not in front of D1, I'm not sure where D1's going to land, right? I, I, maybe maybe here, maybe there, but it's clear that both Rafik and Tendi have vision. They know what needs to be done, and vision is so important. Without vision, how are you going to lead somebody else? You're just going to react. And so, at the moment, I think what I really want to see you want to do is have vision. Is to like, you know what? I know what I need to do now. I know what I need. I don't need to constantly get get like prompted. Ghani's promotion review, we recovered the same thing. We said, Ghani, really good when we tell you what to do. But can you actually do something when we don't tell you what to do? When we just leave you to be, like, let's say, a manager by yourself? Can you actually grow this area? Can you actually improve the content? Can you improve the hospitality on your own? And for that, I don't know if he's ready for that. And so I'm also going to give a no pass for now. But I will also say this. I think. We can bump up his pay, because he shouldn't be paid the same as what he got paid, let's say, right after promotion, or right after probation, right? But as a model for other hosts to follow, um, I don't know about that. Okay, all right, so effectively we have a tie now, right? We've got two and two. So what do we do now? Do we have more discussion, or do we, okay. So we have two, two goes and two nots. Um, do, let's 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 open it around for another discussion. Back to Rafik, back to Tendi. Is there something that we missed, or is there something that needs to be said, or is there an expectation that needs to be changed? Let's go to Tendi again. Yes, sir. So, uh, basically, is that 
me as like uh, the, the teammates of the uh, DL. I feel like uh, I can I can really delegate my area to to him because when when I long time not going to Uluwatu, like last last week or last month I'm going to Changu every day. Then when I came back, like uh, where is the one? I uh, like every every owner like uh, where is the one? Uh, what is the come back? It's like uh, Oh, uh, so I think that's oh, okay. The one is already have a good relationship here. He's also, like uh, some 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 guests as well. Some guests like uh, hi, uh, like uh, where's the one? I want to like uh, ask you answer, ask you something like uh, my reservation, like uh, uh, extend or something. So, and the guests they don't know me and oh yeah, my team is like off. Um, how many help you? It's like I think for the hospitality and then for covering my area is uh, very. He's doing right very well, and then for the revenue also, he really wants to help me to, to cover. He asking me first like, hey, tell me, you you want to move to Changu, and can I take your revenue in Uluwatu? Because I, I think we have uh, many benefits for covering uh, Changu and Ubud and Uluwatu. So, oh yeah, of course. And then uh, like, uh, okay, uh, I will give you this. this. Okay, uh, but can I take uh, like uh, just all and maybe uh, because Chanda is still starting, so give Chanda like a two or three uh, first, and then I will uh, cover the rest. Like, okay. Okay. So I I, I see like uh, the the initiative of of him. Ah. Like, uh, okay. Uh, he he see my my benefits is maybe offer, and then she want to take my bit. So so start from the expansion. I want to delegate full of them, the full of him. So. I think he because he care like uh, the the bit in my area like uh, I think he uh, he can be my my next in Uluwatu and then I can I can uh, leave Uluwatu little bit and then I like step up to the other concern okay. of my because if if, Ulu, if if I still in Uluwatu I cannot like uh, try to uh, making like something uh, new in the yeah, because yeah most thing in area. So I can in the field. Okay, what do you project is, let's say, the future of Uluwatu? What do you think is going to be the future of Uluwatu if D1 remains there? Yeah, in Uluwatu, as you know, now we are like growing only in, only in the below, below of Uluwatu, right? Like the bomb, the club, but I saw like a, some like a, a, in the future, uh, I want I want the one like a, growing in the up area. Upper area like Uluwatu village house, bridge, and then like a, some new in the upper area, and then and then like uh, have a good relationship. So every owner that makes the property can just contact the one, just contact. So we have like a full full area in Uluwatu, not only in the below. So if there is like a, something like uh, the guest asking uh, about for the alternative property, it will be easy because we have the all in Uluwatu area. Okay. Can you one do that? Can you one grow the market by himself? I believe yes, because okay. yeah, like uh, today, just going to the Kayana, mm -hmm. uh, Kayana, this this like a new property, just going there and then explain about the revenue, explain about the Kayana uh, and the, the super villa yeah. next to Bulgari, the Kayana gym, the gym. Oh, you know? okay, okay, that's the Yeah, the Kayana gym. Okay. So they going there, explain to the owner everything. I'm not asking him, but he going there, like uh, make the projection everything. You're so okay. I think. We can like uh, offer you my bits. Okay, all right, very good. Thank you, Tony. So what I understand is you trust Iwan to essentially look after Uluwatu in your half, and then he can represent Uluwatu in a way. Would it be better than the way that you've done it, or would it be like how how would it compare in terms of his as as a delegate, right? How would he do in comparison to your governance of the region? So. Um... I, I will leave like a six month maximum to him for the other because I start him for this month, and then in the in the end of the month I will like just send a survey to the owner without asking him. I will I want to see like a, what is the owner response. I will ask about the communication about the projection mm -hmm. and something that very important. Mm -hmm. So I will see the result from there because uh, if I just like a see maybe I don't have like a more visibility like every single visibility, but. If I just asking the owner, like a, like a personal survey, like a, how's the one doing in order to like that? So I want to see like the data. So we have that. Okay, got it. All right, we'll take a look at the data. Go to Rafik. Rafik, okay. Second round of discussions. Ah, yeah, sure. 
So I'm not uh, what is called uh, comment too much like Delhi. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, because uh, why I pass uh, D one sir? Because I saw he want to grow sir. Okay. That is yeah, he want to grow. Why I say like that? Because uh, I I talk uh, on on behalf of Changu. Mm -hmm. When D one is going to Changu, I'm not sure. Is uh, I'm feeling uh, feel safe here when D one is here. And when I come back to Changu here, hey, where's the one? Mm. So like Tendi said, because I'm not sure why. I think is this is my assume. I think it's because it's the one is Balinese. It's easy to talk with uh, the, the 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 what is called the, the owner, mm -hmm. and you see, and also as as you know, it's uh, the one is really what's called is really really bold with the owner here. Uh, where's the one? The the the, the Joker guy he said the. It seemed like Mipila. Mipila said, Where is Diwan? I like Diwan. Even though the staff said, mm -hmm. That is the first time Diwan is going to China. And I didn't tell, This is the owner of this one, this is the owner of this one. But he, uh, what is called, he learned by himself is going to Changu. And then the second one is Night Shift. So why, why I said uh, that the, the most strong person is uh, a Night Shift. So why? Because I saw it, it's many person at squad one is the one to step on toes, become a night shift person. Mm -hmm. Many person, for example, like Maha, even though Maha already decided, Maha, Ivan is like that. But it's the one, even though, okay, okay, I do that, check, I do that, check, even though he's not going to Malangan, he's never going to Malangan, but he, he wants to take responsibility and he ready to fail, so. Okay. All right. you, you want to learn. That's that I like from you. Okay. All right. Yeah. He seems to have the quality as be the hero. Does anybody have any dispute about that? Is do you want to be the, be hero? the hero? Yeah. Yeah. On the, on the one time this uh, at me villa is uh, one guest. I think it's, I think this is me to of the record. So, mm -hmm. so uh, one guest is uh, broke the motorcycle and. Uh, the one pay for that, I think is seventy five thousand, mm -hmm. and and the guest is very happy with the one. And the 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 Mikula said, yeah, but the one is bayar uh, motornya tidak apa apa. Oh, okay. that is kind of impression for me. So he's helping the guest. And one time is the one said to me, when I was going to Changu with him, that I like. I think I mentioned on the on the comment. The one, one the guest is not the guest, but the one one the guest is his friend. So. Okay. So yeah, this that's that is the and also honor is the friend. same like me. I think, it's, but this I think is me more senior than the one. So the one need to learn. So. Okay. But I think it's the one want to grow. Okay, he wants to grow. Has he grown? Yeah. Has he grown much actually since he's been here? It's grow. Here at Changu, as I know, because he's very close with the owner, mm -hmm. but it's the one is not really often to Changu. You okay. understand what I mean? Got it. So he same like I think he's going to Tendi now. Is about the growing is Tendi need to answer because it's the one is not often to going to Changu. Right? Mm -hmm. If 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 going often to Changu, I think I believe because his owner at Changu is really like the one because okay. it's Balinese, it's easy to talk like that. Okay. All right, yeah. all right. Um, let's go. Okay, let's bring Bayu back. Okay, Bayu. Any any new insights or uh, no, no, any new thoughts? I think I think the the uh, the option here is like uh, uh, or actually the question is do we want to do we want to give the uh, promotion to someone that already achieved the. Uh, Achievement basically, or do we want to give the opportunity to reach the achievement? Yeah, because um, if you if we see uh, that uh, if 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 you look at uh, at that actually, uh, you won't have a lot a lot a lot of uh, potential, uh, but uh, he's not fully uh, delivered that. Mm. Maybe because there's a limitation. So I think. Um, what we can do is uh, that we, we 
and, and, and uh, most of the comment is actually uh, owner facing uh, while he's actually applying for the senior host which is uh, guest facing so uh, we need more uh, evidence in uh, the guests uh, saying that uh, the one is great or there's a new thing uh, hospitality uh, innovation that uh, that he brings or, or he tried so uh, this uh, the explanation from uh, Tendi and uh, Rafik uh, about the, the ownership uh, owner actually um, more into the community manage management uh, and I think that that's pretty good uh, but if uh, if it's uh, for the senior host uh, I think we need to we need to give him uh, opportunity to uh, to prove that uh, to prove that uh, he he will deliver when we give the opportunity okay deliver when he okay all right great let's take a look at let's say on that uh, on that angle can we just look at let's see what his OKRs are right and see what uh, what kind of OKRs is D1 actually setting to deliver on opportunities so <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Um, October. Grow, put off and collaborate with Eggy to find new property, get five leads, two new properties, 20%. Uh, put on, put on. Let's see. September. Better generate revenue for Squad 4 and Monte Cottages. What? He's working on Squad 4 properties? What the? I am asking for help. So. Oh, okay. Learning about the property. Okay, so he's working on okay that involving community project. Meet partners to discuss. Okay, Despacito. Okay, all right. How many of these have been done by you? Despacito, put down, put down, view. Uh, none. None. Okay. All right. Let's go to August. Simplifying phone call with Tendi, Chandra, and Alvin. Okay, we know where that is. July, revenue projections for Padang Padang. Okay, inquiry and conversion request. Okay, June, let's say doctor listing for squad two, agreement, revenue growth. May, easy. oh, I remember these, yeah. These were check-in instructions that we were gonna send out. I guess these are still being used, or I'm not sure. Okay, uh, STP job training program manager. Uh, <laughs> I think eventually Tendi took over on that one. And let's see, March, uh, Ubud has a map guide. Don's over there. Okay, In February, Kutumanak, market building, and this area. Okay, get all this stuff. Okay. All right. So I think yeah, I think I think we need to help him focus. Uh, there's uh, too many things going on, right? So mm. uh, market building, and community management, uh, and hospitality. So uh, which area that uh, we want him to focus on? And back to this again, guys. Look, um, everything is involved. Everything is involved, right? His objective is to involve, involve, mm. involve, mm. involve. Mm. involve. Involved, and so I, I get it. I get it from uh, attendees and Rafa's. Uh, you need somebody that you can rely on, right? You need somebody that you can count on to cover this particular area, so that you can go on to do other things. And I think that's great. That is essentially what we're saying. To, uh, that we're saying that that uh, D one is. He is very reliable, but. I'm very careful about saying what a senior person is. So a senior person should be a standard setter. It should be a person that, once again, back up to it. It's a cultural thing. So if we say this is person is senior, then this person is an example now of how a senior person should behave. This is an example of how, when we talk about leadership, when we talk about stepping up in front, when we talk about getting out there in front of everybody else and showing what that should be done, that's what a senior should look like. And in both cases, I relate back. This is not talking about, like, let's say, reliability. This is not talking about, let's say, um, taking minor initiatives. It should be 
this person has the basics of leadership that three, four, five people should be able to say, hey, look, I want to follow this person. They, they, they have that there. So in this particular revolt, um, this OKR right now is, it's, it's not aligning, right? It's, it, uh, we asked for process excellence, process excellence. What about this is process excellence? How aligned is this person to the overall OKRs of the team, overall OKRs of the company, and overall vision of where we're going to go? Are we going to become the most innovative hospitality company in the world by promoting DWA? So this, this, this is a question. Reliability is one thing. Reliability is very, very important. Dependability is very important. But for senior, it has to be where there is a speck of vision. What is Diwan's vision for Uluwatu? What is his vision for Padang Pana? How does he use his time and his energy to focus on forwarding that vision? I will be happy to say, all right, D1, we're going to pay for reliability, we'll pay for the skill sets that you put in. But for, for, for culture, for bringing that in, I don't know. I don't know. I think, okay, this is, let me put this forward here, right? Let me, let me actually, because promotions have a two-sided risk. Uh, Tendi, you promoted Uti before, right? As we all did, and that didn't work out. So let's just say this. If you're going to promote people who you're going to put in senior positions, the next time when we ask about your promotion, we're going to ask how successful is this person to grow that area that you trusted them to. And if they're not successful, let's just put it this way, that we're not going to look too favorably upon your promotion because as you get more senior up here, majority of how we decide who is more and more senior is based on their judgment. It's based on how they select, how they train, how they mentor, and how they develop their team. And if we're going to say be casual or reckless or inconsistent about who we put into senior positions, then that will have later consequences when we ask, are you ready to be promoted yourself? Okay. So let me just put that out there because we, we need to agree on this. We can't have a, have a game where everyone agrees, I'll promote you and you support me, because that is moral hazard. So, Tendi, do you accept that risk that at your next promotion, D1 has to succeed in order for you to get promoted? Yes, sir. Okay, all right, good. Rafik, do you accept that risk that your promotion would be inhibited? If you, D1 would have to succeed if you are to promote it to the next level. Okay, so this is the best point. Okay, all right. It's about delegation. It's about delegation. It truly is. Okay. It's about delegation. So, if your delegate fails, yeah. you yeah. fail. Delegation, if I delegate something to D1, mm -hmm. it's not come back to me with the question. It's mm -hmm. come back to me with the result. Okay. So that is, that is the point why I believe him. Okay. That's why. So the delegation is not about how... Uh, how do you hosting and everything? The senior host is supposed to be strong. It's not only for the guests, but only, uh, but it's also for the ownership. Okay. Because now we really, really, really many competitors. Yes. We need a very strong person to keep this bucket pista. That's 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 I mean. Okay. Because, but that's one I want to delegate the one as a strong a strong person to keep. Uh, the, the the relationship between Bukit Pista and that's that's all, Understood. and then I believe it. So. Okay, all right. So yeah. you're voting in confidence that it's essentially his success is tied to your success. Okay, all right. 